Today, I'm going to be comparing MLB The Show 22 on PS4 and Switch. Now, if you guys want to see more of this content, please let me know. Uh, I'll compare more games that are between Switch and PlayStation. But uh, yeah, let's subscribe if you haven't. Let's get on. Yeah, okay, cool. Subscribe, like the video, check out socials. Okay, let's get on to the video. So here we are, MLB The Show 20, uh, 22, not 21, 22 on the PS4. Ta-da. Um, this game has an update, and I'm not willing to sit and wait for the update. We're not going online or anything, and the only thing that really doesn't show is the servers. So you won't see how many subs I have, but you'll see it on uh, the Switch. But yeah, so I went out a, about a week ago. I don't want to say a week ago, maybe a little bit, a little bit less. Um, and I picked up MLB The Show 22 on the Switch for the sole reason that it was on sale. And that it was also on the Switch so I could bring it with me wherever I go because I feel like it. I, I don't bring my Switch anywhere. That's, that's not really what I do. I will eventually. All right. Um... <laughs> So I decided let's just straight up make a video comparing them. Uh, so if we go back again, like I said, PS4, you can see up in the, the top corner. We're just going to go, the, the, the thing is, we're just going to go Blue Jays, damn it, Blue Jays and, sure, Blue Jays and Braves. Um, we're just going to stick to the normal thing. Now what we're going to do is we're going to show the comparison. I'm not going to play any full games, frankly. This doesn't really matter. None of this actually matters. It doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things just because I'm trying to put a base. This is the base. This is what you see if I was recording. Um, if I'd be recording, I won't be the show or streaming over on my Twitch. This is what you would see. What you would not see is the Switch. And I'll tell you, it's something else. So, um, some of you may have the PS4 or PS5 or the Xbox Series S. I don't need to I don't need to watch the transition, but you'll see both. Jose right, just about set to go and I want to talk. I want to talk. Now it's quieter. Um so as you see, the shading is nice. There's a lot of things with this game that um are really nice. But one of the, also the other things is, if you go back to MLB The Show about s MLB 16-ish, like when it first came over to the PlayStation f uh, PS4, uh, the shading was insane. I'll throw up a couple pictures if I can find them. But it was, it looked really, really good. And then over time, they kind of focused less on the graphics. And that's how that kind of became that. Ooh. Anywho, that's fine. Um, <clears throat> me, me, me. So, with if you have a PS4, uh, PS4, PS5, actually, easy double play. If you have a PS5, you will kind of see that the graphics and all this are really nice. It was a lot like when PS3 went to PS4. Uh, where they were, the graphics were amazing and then kind of settled in, if that makes sense, to what they look like as of now. Um, when we go to the Switch, there's a huge change that you will immediately figure out. Just to see, it. honestly, we're just trying to get the overall graphics or how it looks. Looks clean, looks nice. Um, is really cool of course this game you know looks amazing kind of plays all right except for the fact that i can't hit for my life um but it looks good never mind i think i'm playing on like rookie i don't remember what i said to it it might be It's amateur, okay. It's 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 a half step up from rookie. I really don't care at this point. We're just trying to get through this. Um, sounds good. 
Commentary is the same. We don't have to worry about that. Sounds are the same. Uh, display and everything is actually the same. It's it's on the Switch. You will tell that it is an MLB The Show. Now we have Vladdy Daddy, um, of course. Uh, damn it. But you, you can tell pretty quickly that it, it, it will be the same. Okay. You got the runner windows. It, it's nice. Well, that's what we like to see. Ah, very nice. But you get the overall look of it. It looks nice. It plays all right. Um, you kind of get, you get the point. You get the point. Um, I want to finish out the inning. I don't think I'll be able to finish out the inning. <laughs> Should have like a one inning game. Would have got some stubs out of it. I know I wouldn't even get stubs out of it. Go back to back to back. No. Um, you get the point. It's it's the base. Yeah, I'll pause it here. Um, it's the base. You, it's what's what you're used to. It's what you've seen all the time. It's nice. You get the point. Um, now the switch. This is where it gets a little different. Now uh, a, a cut to the switch. I guess while we wait for uh, my switch to my PlayStation to fully turn off, uh, subscribe to my second channel, uh, Tendy Tendy Two. Uh, link in the description. Kind of sweet, kind of nice. Uh, you'll see more of me and uh, vlogs. Hopefully, will be coming soon. Okay, no guarantees, but okay, okay. Uh, now to the switch. So as now you can see, we are on the switch. Uh, I mean, no, no shot. You can't see anything. If you also want to see a video comparing Apex, if I download that game, please be my guest. I don't think there's any other games. If you want to see a Nintendo Switch sports game? Let me know. Uh, I'll compare. Oh, I'll compare. Also, we'll do that. We'll do a comparison video. We'll do that thing. So let's log into our our Switch. As you see, really quick. That is the one thing I'll give the Switch. It is really quick. When it comes to loading, especially loading up games, it is insanely quick. You don't need to see that. That's if you play the game. I'm not down to get copyright. The music. Give me a minute. Hold on. Cut. Give me a minute. I need to go turn off the music. Hold on. Cut. Cut. Leave. Leave my sights. <laughs> dropped the remote. I dropped a remote. I dropped a remote. Okay. Well. Remember how I said the game was taken for, you know, it was quick to load? Yeah, it's, it's to load up, not to load into the game. Okay, good enough. So as you see, it we are back. Uh, now we are on the Switch. Uh, you can kind of see up in the corner, it's a little blended in. There you go, now you can see it. 43,000 subs. This is what took me forever to actually do this video. I needed to connect my PS4 account, the PS4 MLB account to my Switch. I realized after I picked up the Switch, that I didn't connect it properly because I went back to my PlayStation and it had all my Switch stuff on it, which had nothing. So I figured it out, fixed it. Now I have 43,000 subs. That's also what is on my PlayStation. Cool. Uh, so we are going to just straight up. It, it. I will tell you this. The menus, cut and copy. You cannot tell the difference. There's neg like less. There's little to none lag. It is... Uh, moves pretty smooth it's good it's a menu it's not that hard right there you can kind of tell there's a little bit of difference when it comes to the players I will say that do you also need to turn off the we we'll also need to turn off the audio so I'm not down to listen to Matt fast no not Matt fast the other guy the new guy whatever his face is um you will tell, I think, when we load in that there is a little bit of a difference, and I'll, I'll, I'll I might, I'll play, uh, I'll take a little bit.
I don't know how this ru So just about set. So now Hold on. I have yet to play this game on the TV. Okay, okay, there's a little bit of difference. Uh, other than the controls, which you see the thing. It looks a little bit different. Now, if you play it on handheld mode, you can kind of see it there too. It looks a little more pixelized. Uh, I'm not sure how well you can see it. I can pick it up and show you on the Switch, but it's a little more pixelized, which you can kind of see because of the Switch power. And now, you can see the outline a little bit. I'm not sure how it looks in the recording. It might look actually really good, but it's one of those things where it, lo it looks all right. I want to get the hitting. Oh. Almost got him. But you can kind of see... You can see a little bit of it. It looks... It looks alright. In handheld mode is kind of where it... Doesn't thrive. If that makes sense. I have the worst route to that ever um you can kind of see here it's a little more more pixely i may show it off in the handheld mode because that's where you can really see the difference but i will say this is my first time playing it on the actual tv not bad it's not that bad actually i want to get a double play damn it You hurt my leg. Um, the controls, it's on a... Okay, Angel Hernandez. Um, the controls, it's on a Switch Joypad, or uh, Joy-Con, Joypad thing. Eh! I think it would be better on a Pro Controller. Oh my god, this guy's hitting everything. No, just absolute heater. Just heater right down the middle. Finally. Only 11 and a half pitches. Um, but you can kind of see it with the shading. It's all right. It's not the best quality. PlayStation was a better quality. Um controls it handles all right i mean i wouldn't say it's the best but it's handles pretty pretty smooth i will say i think the joystick uh on the switch is a little more sensitive which i don't personally like disgusting absolutely got him looking um It just hit me that it looks ex it looks almost the exact same on TV. Oh, you can kind of see it in the shadows. Well, I hit bombs. Never mind. That's a that's a double. When you pick it up and you look at it on the the handheld, it's one of those things where you need to see it on the handheld. Oh god. Send. Absolute. Um you can kinda see it's a little pixely here. But it's a lot better than I thought it was, I guess because it's HDMI, it's not on a little tablet. Vladdy didn't hit a bomb. This is the worst version of MLB the show ever. the worst version ever but you can see where it is now i think i'll kind of just stop and pick up the switch if i ever hit a home run i want to hit a home run first never mind but it, especially with the batting and the pci it's a little sensitive which i don't i don't like i mean the game looks 
I. This was a dumb idea. This was a dumb idea. This was a dumb idea. It was a great idea. I'm a genius. Um. It's honestly better than I expected. Coming off the TV. Gone. That's never coming home. Okay, we hit a home run. Now, what I'll do. Oh, I have to replay. I forgot. Um, what I'll do. Hold on. Now. You see it here. Oh. Um. So you see it here, right? Uh, let me turn off the TV. Uh, that's just the reflection off the thing. So you see it here, right? So if I hit back, um, it's a little pixely. It's a little more pixely. I'm not sure how well it comes across the camera. Uh, I'm trying to get the right angle. Can I hit a home run with it off here? No, but I hit a single. <laughs> I actually got a hit. Um, it's a lot like I was chatting too. It's a lot like uh, the PSP on handheld mode. If you guys ever played the PSP, which I bet you have, but it's it's a lot like that when it comes to. Um, the switch in handheld mode that's pretty much how i've been playing it for the past half week or so um other than that i think it's all right uh, it's it's it is a full mlb game on the nintendo switch i'm not complaining i think it's really good um so what are your guys's comments in the opinion or what's your opinion put it down in the comments uh if you think if you have the game what do you think about it uh especially in handheld mode graphics and all that other than that, it's a full MLB game. It's nice. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Tell your friends. And uh, when in doubt, 10D out.